Hey guys, what's up? Today, we're going to install MIUI 8 running on Android Marshmallow 6.0.1 on the Samsung Galaxy Note 2. Let's get started. So before starting, you need to have a custom recovery installed. For that, visit our website. The link is in the description box below. Also, download the latest ROM corresponding to your particular model as well as Google Apps from the link in the description box below and save it to your phone or your SD card. Now start by pressing volume up, home and power button all together. Keep holding them until your device turns off and you see the Samsung Galaxy Note 2 logo and then leave them to boot into recovery. Make sure you have the latest DWRP or Clockwork Mod recovery installed. Once you are in the recovery, make sure to make a backup. This makes things easier to revert back to the previous ROM. Now go back, go to wipe, swipe to factory reset. Now go back to the main menu and go to install. Navigate to the folder where you saved your ROM. Now select the ROM and swipe to flash. Once the installation finishes, if you see an error saying unable to mount storage, please ignore it as the ROM installation is successful. Now once done, go back again and similarly select the Google Apps and swipe to flash. Now select reboot system. Wait for the phone to boot up. It may take a few minutes, so be patient. The phone has finally booted up. Let's check the Android version. It is running on MIUI 8 beta layered over Android Marshmallow 6.0.1 Everything works out of the box including Wi-Fi, network, data, calling and camera as well. Image capture mode works. You get HDR mode along with normal mode. And also video recording works just fine. So checking out settings. You get status bar customizations. Second space for multiple usages. A very good feature for people with multiple numbers, dual apps. You can also edit button settings, change the button functionality and backlight settings, and finally, quick ball. So basically every feature of MIUI 8 works out of the box and the performance is also very pleasant and works flawlessly. And this ROM is built over Cyanogen mod, but most of the ROMs built on Cyanogen mod for the Note 2 have video playback error. But not on this one, video works in all apps, both system and third party. So with all the features and the stability, it can be easily used as a daily driver. So guys do try out this ROM and let me know what you think about it. So guys thank you so much for watching, I'll catch you in the next one.